two days to the coronation, the behind the scene of the preparation of the coronation of the Oba of Ife. Hello guys, so this is another like night time. Um, Lovina Mario is simple Nigerian event hostess, event coordinator, and event planner in training. So um, I know I have shown like my whole journey to Ibadan, to Ife, Leife, my auto Leife right now for the coronation of their new Oba. And um, I'm working with Amazon Events as um, an event coordinator. So this particular job. I am the coordinator. <laughs> okay, so I have shown all those journey and all the the vendors meeting, the venue okay and everything. Nice. And I want to just like do my skincare. Do my skincare and then just sleep. Get real rested for tomorrow. Tomorrow is another very blessed day. I don't call it hectic or blessed because tomorrow we're adding things into the hall. To all our arrangements for the actual coronation. So, unlike other skincare, I am going to be doing double cleansing. Why? Because on the road today, no, my skin needs to be pampered. Baby girl, you need to be pampered. The dust, <laughs> I have to double cleanse my face before doing anything. Just triple cleanse my face before doing anything. Dust was something else. And uh, let's just get right into the video. So I just finished um, taking my bath and then um, I have my face wet so I'm going to go ahead and start washing immediately. Yeah, so I have a video about my nighttime skincare routine. I will drop the link in my bio to click on it to watch how I prep my skin at night. So this video I'll just be running through it like in a flash and um, just let's just get on with it. So I'm all done, see my face is now dried. I got dressed and I quickly went down for dinner. This was like past it two days before the day of the coronation. A day before the coronation. Good morning. I had breakfast real quick, paint some plantain and we went to the venue to supervise what they've been doing overnight and they did a pretty good um job with decorators this was like 50 percent done meanwhile the outside was still looking like a heap of trash but inside was looking like, like a very very fine face i know you guys saw the before look of this hall this is it yes and now look at what it is now the outside is still looking like trash like proper trash we we're even scared that it won't get ready like before um the coronation the next day there were cement sand paper bag a lot of things on the ground they were ever just too dirty like due to the, the construction they had um building the doors and the windows everything was just so scattered and all we could do was just wait patiently nothing much while inside the hall this was about 7 30 ish the day before the coronation was already looking so so fine just look at this hall look at the glamour look at the lights the flowers everything was just so on point all we had to do was just sweep the hall clean it up put a few um finishing touches here and there and we we're good and set for the coronation day but outside was still looking like a mess well we could only hope that they will get done with um the cleanup in time for the coronation the next day this was about 8 30 ish and we had to go home these are i and my colleague well we had to rest for the next day which was like going to be very very hectic we already knew and this is the morning of the coronation good morning the hall was set all looking so beautiful well swept clean 
and surprisingly they got done with the entrance for the morning of the coronation thank god they will set up they kicked off the event by singing the nigerian national anthem and Buddha keke anthem After the coronation of the Oba, the celebration began proper as you have seen. Meanwhile, outside, lots of food. This is the Asu. Hmm. We had over five canopies for food Chinese, Amala, uh, Ofa the rice, Tifa rice, Jello fries. A lot of food, name it. We were just going in and coming out. We had caterers, we had drinks, different kind of drinks, and we had a lot of people constituting news and outside. <laughs> The celebration continued with food, drinks, small chops, going in and coming out and everybody was happy, people celebrated their new Oba. You could tell that he was really really loved by the people. And we came to the end of the event with my face, my tired face actually, <laughs> but I was so happy. There's like no greater joy than seeing the end of an event you planned and coordinated for. There were still a few people around eating and drinking, but the event was over already and soon the hall became empty. People started leaving one after the other and it was a wrap. Thank you for watching this video. Like and subscribe. Thank you so much.